everybody. It's Ryan, Spoon, CCW in Minerva, Ohio. Hey, we're just out here at the range. Uh, got, you know, grill going. The kids over there sitting in the Jeep, enjoying the day. Got some pretty rough weather, but still out here getting some practice in. Uh, basically, what I want to do here is everybody, you know, the instructors out there, videos you watch, everybody's got videos of them teaching someone else, uh, how they work with students, that sort of stuff. What I wanted to show today was that we work on our own skills continuously uh, as often as we can, honing our skills in, keeping everything sharp. But, uh, yeah, a little bit of gunfire in the background. Sorry about the, the sound quality here. As soon as a couple guys come in, uh, I'll have them tell you what kind of drills they're running. Uh, we got a, got a rifle, rifle drill running out here, a couple different pistol drills. Uh, Rodney running his Ruger. That loud, beautiful sound. Jason over here with the AR pistol. He's running some, uh, looks like some transition drills. Rifle and pistol. Uh, the Ronda down here, she's waiting to come in. Doesn't want to cross the fire. Uh, looked like she was running some drills. We'll go talk to Rodney real quick here. What are you running today, Rod? Oh, I'm just giving a little bit of practice to reload skills. And uh, I'm starting out with a dead chamber. Um, no, no round in a chamber and then a tap and rack drill and then uh, shoot two rounds in the A zone uh, with a flash sight picture at 21 feet and then uh, technical two round reload two shots in the A zone reload again two shots in the A zone it's real just a repetitive drill that you hone your skills make sure you have your uh, firearm out in front of you when you can see it and never leave your sight picture sight alignment you know things Great. like that cool thanks yep Jay yeah this is Jason Spoon. What are we running today? Well, running a couple transition drills. Uh, really, all I'm doing is putting a couple shots on target, bring the rifle down, and I'll switch back and forth from short target to long target. When I'm running a rifle, I like to use the, the small targets. Reload, you can do some reloads inside of that drill. Um, when you run out with your rifle, essentially you're gonna put your rifle down, switch your pistol. I like to do a draw and fire, a couple shots on the close target, reholster, draw and fire, a couple shots on the long target. That way you go from using a flashlight picture to actually having to take your time and aim and, and hit the, the target at 45 feet. So we've got multiple drills inside of a drill yeah, there. Yeah, pretty much. Very cool, very cool. Rhonda, what were you working on today? I was working on my flashlight picture. I was doing it low ready, double tap, and then repeat that to work on my aim and my flashlight drills. Awesome, sounds great. That's that's a few of us. Uh, got other instructors that couldn't make it to the range today. But, uh, you know, every chance we get, we're down here honing our skills too. Uh, we don't wanna be those instructors that are constantly preaching at, 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 at you know, our students or uh, customers at the store or anything like that without practicing what we preach. But um, but yeah, come see us. We're in Minerva, Ohio, right on market. A lot of people know it as the brick road. A uh, lot of classes we offer. Uh, you guys have a good one. Uh, enjoy the rest of the weekend, or if you're watching this video later, enjoy the week. Uh, we'll talk to you guys later, thanks.